what it is and what's up family it's your boy Craig fifth here again and we are talking about film photography and everything in between like always if you didn't know didn't see um or just don't have the best memory i just wrapped up a project or a web series called i'll name this dish later working with the host and the chef mr shamir um i just call him chef so anyways, we finished the season back in early early fall, late summer. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to kind of reflect on it. So we're going to go over a few things today just to kind of highlight and continue to shine that light on this process, this project. Um, first off, the idea. Uh, secondly, we we'll go over the partnership. Um, thirdly, the execution. And lastly, the success from it. So yeah, let's, let's get into that. So I'm not sure how long Chef had this idea, but the idea was essentially a cooking show where he would bring guests on like traditional shows of like uh, Rachel Ray or where they bring someone in to show them like how they do what they do. But he wanted to put a, a spin on it where it was kind of, he set the he set the stage and what we did was kind of based off what the guests like brought to the table. So. Given, given control or power to the actual guests, I think is that that's pretty dope. So whether or not the meal came out good, like yeah, the goal is to have a good meal, of course, but we put the power in this person's hand and we either gonna make something good or we just, it's, we gonna have to Uber some food in. Or it just like, I think that's really cool, man, cause it takes away all the stress of like trying to make a perfect whatever. It's more fun, it's more interactive. Um, more engaging and I think the guests probably appreciated that of course they were there and they were just kind of nervous and just wanted to wanted to be there and wanted to experience like the other side of, of, of cooking because a lot of people don't cook he's he's he does that like he enjoys it that's one of his passions so so after bringing those people into his world cooking with them we'll have an interview portion where he kind of dives into what they do and things that they're passionate about what they what they want to speak on and like certain if they have a business or if they're doing something for a good cause those things he wants to highlight those of course but also it just turned into genuine conversation that, that that you could just sit back and you know listen to it kind of get a understand someone's background understand someone's journey i think that's really dope and i think it was dope for him to kind of humbly take the back seat like during some of these cooking sessions where it's like hey what you want to do I, he will, of course, advise certain things, but it's like just giving that that kind of that that cool genuine touch to uh, a traditional cooking show. So that 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 was really dope. She'll be back, buddy. Relax. Come on. We got a visitor. So partnership. So my buddy just wanted to jump into the video. Say hello. Everybody, this is Biggie. He'll probably pop his head up every once in a while, but he just likes to sit on my lap. So yeah, when he brought the brought the idea to me, um, I thought it was dope. It wasn't something I had seen before, and I was just like, uh, something I would love to be a part of. I was appreciative that he even reached out to me because it's not like I was shooting food or interviews or anything like that at this time. Like, I didn't have any of that experience. So I was like, wondering why it came to me, but. I was happy he did because I had been itching to do something. And I think he shot the first one in the summer of 2021. Learned a lot from that episode. Um, and pretty much that translated to the next one. We learned a lot, all the things that we didn't like, did like, we just kind of honed in on and made sure that the second and third one were each episode has gotten better than the first or the one previously. So I'm very, very appreciative of him and kind of understanding what my vision for this vision that he has, wrapping it nicely for the audience. So your execution as well. Our success has been, I think, in my eyes, very, very good because it's been very well received. There are people wanting to be on the show next. Uh, they're waiting for season two. I think the season finale really, really did well. It was like a two part thing. And I think it kind of wrapped up the 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 first season really, really well. So yes, it was a success. Um, so shout out to, to Chef Shem, man. 
and there's more there will be more man so continue to tap in uh please go subscribe to click the bell b i n t b l show and yeah man watch this watch this growth because there's a lot more that that can happen like we really really just tip of the iceberg type of thing as always i appreciate y'all tapping in support has always been unreal and yeah man like comment subscribe to the i'll name this later show i don't need anything over here but i would like you guys to go check out that project man it's something that we put a lot of time into and it really mean a lot to me if you all just you know give it a little a little uh screen time if you may and uh, holidays coming up. Enjoy your holidays. And, yeah, man, enjoy today. You know. And until next time, peace, love, and all the above.